Welcome to yoga. Let's begin in a standing position at the top of your space. With your feet either together or even hip distance apart is fine. Bring your hands together at heart center. Stand tall through the crown of your head and close your eyes. Take a moment to connect with your roots. Not only the roots of your practice, the roots of this present moment, but the roots of your life. What brought you here? And find gratitude for everything that made you who you are today. And in this gratitude, open your eyes. Reach your arms up for mountain pose. Take a big inhale. Then exhale to sweep your arms down and back like airplane arms. At the same time, step your left foot back into a nice deep lunge. Take a moment to settle into your lunge. Sink your weight into your right foot. And then reach your arms overhead for a crescent lunge. And just stretch into this, adding any movement that feels good for you. And from here, we'll add a twist. Bring your hands together at heart center. Take a big inhale to lengthen your spine, then exhale, twist to the right. Now you can stay here with your hands at heart center, or you can open your arms in your twist. Right arm reaches back, left arm reaches forward, or take it one step further. Bring your hands together at heart center and lower down to hook your left elbow outside of your right knee. Find the twist that serves you now, then breathe into it for three, two, one. Rise up, back to crescent lunge, arms reach up, sinking deep into your hips, big inhale. Then open up into warrior two. With your right knee tracking open, right arm reaching forward, left arm reaching back. For a reverse triangle, straighten out both legs and reach your right arm high. And you can just stretch right here or add a sky archer variation by grabbing your right wrist overhead, stretching into it and flexing your right toes back. Next is triangle pose. Hinge at your hips to reach your right hand forward and then lower your right hand down to your right shin, left arm reaches high. Now in a pose like this, it's not about reaching the ground. Think like a tree and reach up towards the sky. Give yourself lift. When this pose is active with that lift, you're not only stretching, but also strengthening, which is essential for a mobile body. Use your core to rise. For horse pose, pivot your left toes to point out, bend both knees open, and sit down deep. For our first horse, this is going to be pretty intense, so go ahead and place your hands to your thighs and lower your right shoulder down as you press your right knee away. And feel free to add a little bit of movement, like wiggling side to side. Then come back to center and switch sides. Lower your left shoulder down as you press your left knee away. Then bring your hands to heart center and find warrior two. Pivot your left toes in as you straighten out your left leg, reaching your arms front and back, just like you did before. Now keep your legs as they are and take reverse warrior. Reach your right arm high as your left hand grazes your back thigh. For extended side angle, legs will continue to stay the same. Just hinge forward as you lower your right arm down and your left arm high. You can always modify this with your elbow to your thigh because just like in triangle pose, this is less about reaching the ground and it's more about lifting up towards the sky. So find that lift as you rotate your chest open, leaning back into your left shoulder for three, two, one. Inhale to rise, place your hands on your hips, shift your hips forward and step your back foot forward, coming to the top of your mat. Let's do the left side. Inhale to mountain pose, reach your arms up. As you exhale, sweep your arms down and back and step your right foot back into your deep lunge. Take a moment to settle in with your hips squared off to the top of your mat, weight anchoring down into your left foot so you're in a deep lunge. Reach your arms overhead for the full crescent lunge and take a moment here just to stretch it out, whatever feels good for you.
For the twist, bring your hands together at heart center, take a big inhale, first lengthen your spine, then exhale, twist to your left, twisting through your shoulders, your chin, even through your gaze. To help with balance, set your gaze on one spot anywhere on that left side. Take the same option of the twist that you took on the other side, whether it's opening your arms or going into your full revolved crescent lunge, and breathe. A deep, slow breath creates space in this twist, releases tension in this twist, and keeps you calm. Three, two, one. Come back to center, reach your arms up, and take a big stretch in your crescent lunge, even leaning back if that feels good for you. And then open up into warrior two. Left knee tracking open, arms reaching front and back, find your strong warrior two, and then for reverse triangle, Straighten out your left leg, reach your left arm high, and add the sky archer variation if you do on the other side. Or try it if it's something that's new for you. Big inhale. Exhale to triangle pose. Hinge at your hips. If you're a sky archer, you'll lower your left foot back down. Left arm goes down, right arm goes high. And again, do your best to stay lifted in this pose. You're not caving down towards the ground. Instead, it's as if you were leaning against a wall behind you. The entire back of your left thigh, your arms, your hips, your shoulders, and the back of your head would be touching that wall. Three, two, one. Rise up, then find horse pose. Heels in, toes out, knees bend open, and do your best to get your weight anchoring down into the pinky side edges of both feet. So you're lifting your arches. Sink low in your hips, bring your hands together at heart center, and feel free to add a little wiggle side to side as you settle in. For three, two, one. Inhale to rise. And exhale, set up warrior two. Left knee bends open, arms reaching front and back. Keep your legs as they are for reverse warrior. Reach your left arm high, right arm grazing your back thigh. Really stretching through your left hand. And then for extended side angle, legs stay the same. Just hinge forward, left arm down, right arm high. And take the modification elbow to thigh if you did on the other side. It really does help with giving you the lift in the pose so that you're not dumping down towards the ground. If you do have your arm inside of your knee, then use that leverage forearm inside of your knee to press your knee open and also to rotate your right shoulder back. Three, two, one. Inhale to rise, hands to your hips. Exhale to pivot your hips forward and step your back foot forward. Coming into a standing position, top of your mat, hands together at heart center. Close your eyes, find your breath. Ground down, stand tall. And we will flow through that sequence, one breath, one movement. But find the pace that serves you, even if at points it's two breaths, one movement, that's okay too. So when you're ready, exhale everything from your lungs, then inhale to open your eyes, reach your arms up for mountain pose. Exhale to airplane your arms, step your left foot back into your deep lunge. Inhale, crescent lunge, arms reach up. Exhale, hands to heart center and twist to the right, finding the twist that serves you. Inhale, back to your crescent lunge, arms reach up, and as you exhale, open up into warrior two, right knee tracking open. Inhale, reverse triangle or sky archer, both legs are straight. Exhale to your triangle pose, find your lift. Inhale to rise, set up your horse pose as you exhale, sink down nice and low. Inhale to rise, set up your warrior two, exhale, settle into your warrior two. 
reverse warrior as you inhale. Extended side angle as you exhale, pace your breath. Inhale to rise, hands to your hips. Exhale to pivot and step your back foot forward. For mountain pose as you inhale, arms reach up. Airplane as you exhale, step your right foot back. Crescent lunge as you inhale, arms reach up. And twist to your left as you exhale. Find your depth. Inhale back to your crescent lunge, arms up. Exhale to warrior two, open up. Reverse triangle or sky archer as you breathe in. Create length. Then triangle pose as you exhale and use that length. Inhale to rise, setting up your horse pose. And as you exhale, get low. Inhale to rise, setting up warrior two. And as you exhale, settle in, commit to those legs, reverse warrior breath in, and left arm high. To extended side angle, breath out, left arm down, right arm high. Inhale to rise, hands to your hips. As you exhale, pivot and step your back foot forward. One more time, mountain pose, inhale. Airplane, step your left foot back as you exhale. Fewer cues. Crescent lunge, arms reach up. And twist to your right. Inhale back to crescent lunge. To warrior two. Reverse triangle breath in. Triangle pose. Then inhale to rise as you exhale, horse pose. Inhale to rise for warrior two. Reverse warrior breath in. Extended side angle breath out. Inhale to rise, hands to your hips as you exhale, pivot and step your back foot forward. For mountain pose, breath in. Airplane arm, step your right foot back. Inhale, arms reach up. Then exhale, twist to your left. Inhale, arms reach up. Warrior two. Reverse triangle to triangle pose. And inhale, rise, exhale, horse pose. Inhale, rise, exhale, warrior two to reverse warrior to extended side angle. Follow your breath. And when you're through, meet me in standing at the top of your mat. Hands at heart center. Find your breath, find your calm, and then find tree pose. Bend your right knee open to place the sole of your right foot on your ankle, calf, or inner thigh. Then set your gaze and reach your arms overhead. Grow tall. Be like a tree. Whenever obstacles come into your path, grow around them. Lower your hands down and switch sides. Place your left foot on your ankle, calf, or inner thigh. And reach your arms overhead. And be like a tree. Grow deep in your roots. and tall through your branches. As strong as can be in between. Bring your hands down, lower your left foot down. 
and come back to the top of your mat, Samastitihi, hands at heart center, stand tall through the crown of your head, take a big breath in, big breath out, and be like a tree with a gentle smile on your face. From the tree that is me to the tree that is you. Namaste.